Welcome to the Fab Four Travel Talk Podcast with Christy, Gina, Eric, and Kyle. Now, sit back and relax. Let's chat about some magical destinations. Hi, everybody. Welcome to this week's podcast. I'm Gina, and I am the host this week, and we are all together, so that means we've got... What are you doing? Every time you count down, it reminds right. me of that song. Five, four, uh, three, two... Yep. Okay. okay. Sorry. Yep. Hi, Gina. That reminds me. We've got there. Eric. Hello. <laughs> and Christy. Hi there. And Kyle. Hi there. Kyle. Major Tom. Major, Major Tom. Tom. Call you Major Tom. Ooh, Major Tom. Ooh, there you go. Major Tom. Another song that reminds so, me of that every time we now. Right. Anyway. Hi, everyone. <laughs> okay. Good. What Jeez. was our topic tonight? I think it was supposed to be something about being a, you know, your Disney fanatic when? Exactly. What are some some key signs? No Sp- maps. Yeah, I, Bingo. I, I agree with that. Yeah. Was- you always make your dining reservations because you'll see people that, you know, well, uh, every time we're in, anywhere we go to eat when we're there, you'll see these poor people come in. Can you have a table for four? Sure. At 1035. Tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> you know? Tomorrow. Yeah, and we're the ones that are always over to the side, just laugh, bawling, just right. dying, right. laughing when people watching people will come in to do that. We try not to try not to laugh at them, but we really have a good time, just like, oh. kind of going ha ha ha. I really want to go walk up to those people and just hand me my hand them my card. Yeah. Go next time. Yeah, I right. get your reservation. I can do this for you. Right. Yeah. Save you the embarrassment. Mm-hmm. I'm trying to think of some other. You know, you're a Disney fanatic when you buy. A cruise, or you go on a cruise specifically for a Disney blanket. <laughs> uh, yeah. Either that, or you're yeah. obsessed with blankets. Who are you talking about? I don't know. Who or maybe you're, both. Who you're could be both. Yeah. 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 <laughs> That's yeah. how you know you're a Disney fanatic. Yeah, mm-hmm. that happens. Well, I was going to say the other thing too is like you know you're a Disney fanatic when you're actually trying to engage with cast members, like just sit and chat, chat with them. Yeah. Now, not to ask them directions or what time the three o'clock parade is, but how long have Actually you worked here? What them. other rooms right. have yep. you had? Like, yeah. Yeah. I love a, that. When you have a restraining order out. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Yeah. When you have your picture on a pillow with a cast member. I mean, right. <laughs> you might facts, be a fanatic but... if you can give of the VIP yeah, tour that's guide. True. That's, true. <laughs> yeah. that's what it takes. That's or when you go on a VIP tour guide and you have a different tour guide. Or you go on a VIP tour. Time. Cause if you go on a VIP tour guide, that's a totally different story. <laughs> Although you may be a Disney fanatic. If <laughs> yeah, that puts you up there. Thanks, I mean, Eric. I'm thinking, I'm thinking that's right on top there. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh God. <laughs> yeah. I give up. Yeah. Safe travels, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Christy, what were you going to say if you go on your second VIP tour? Right. And then you tell the, the tour guide stuff you learned the last time. And they're like, <laughs> really? I didn't know that. You might be a Disney fan. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Wow. I was like, well, Kirk told me this. So, yes, that's true. You can ask him. Yeah. You should like, go ask Kirk. And right. they go, oh, Kirk. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, him. Oh, yeah. Kirk, yeah. 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 Sorry, you got stuck with me? Sorry. Right. Yeah. I bet you requested him, huh? Yeah. <laughs> you might be a Disney fanatic if you know Kirk. If you know right, Kirk. Right, if you yep. know Kirk. If you know Kirk, you're, you're up there. You might be a Disney cruise fanatic if you uh, have been on all the ships. What's that called? Grand Slam. Yeah, the grand. if you've got a Grand, grand slam. slam. We're working on it. No, I'm we're getting- not. I'm getting my grand They're slam. They're working on it. The end of this month. Hey, never mind then. I mean, you're not though. Thanks. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> See, there you go, Eric. I guess we're not, huh? Well, I mean, I'm I can not. help you work on it. Oh, I'm sure you could. I, yes. I know a girl. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Right. I know. I a can girl. help you work on it. I'd right, love to work on it. Absolutely love to work on it. Well. You might be a Disney Cruise fanatic if you already have money saved for bingo. Yes. <laughs> you might be a Disney cruise fanatic if you spent more money on bingo than the cruise. <laughs> <laughs> that hasn't so, happened. Somebody looks guilty. Right. No. <laughs> I almost it, always play. In right. fact, I was planning not to play this time. And then, of course, 
one of my trusty friends that are going on the cruise was like, Campbell. I can't wait to play. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Paul <laughs> Campbell. Say, troublemaker. Right. He's like, bingo, my bingo buddy. I'm like, oh, there's trouble. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. I guess okay. I'll have to play. All right. <laughs> Thanks, Jen. Appreciate it. Oh, All right. Man. How else can you be a fanatic? Oh. Hmm. Oh, you're a Disney fanatic if you've done a 5K on Castaway Key. And a run on land. Oh, that's only applicable to one person in this room. No. Eric. Eric. Yeah, no. Well, no yeah, I was so thinking Christy had done it, yeah. but she, you didn't do the 5K. No, you on didn't Castaway. do the 5K. Yeah. Four how about you in the morning might, thing. How about you might be a fanatic if you've done all four parks, including an yeah. extra event in the day? Yeah, in one day. That's one day, one. All yep. hands up and you there. rode, and you rode rides, yep. and you right. might have gotten a wheelchair somewhere along. <laughs> yeah, you, <laughs> along might, you might have needed a wheelchair <laughs> <Exactly>. somewhere. <laughs> what if you buy your groceries and your reusable bags are Disney bags? That's pretty. That's bad. pretty good. That's, yep. I actually met somebody at the grocery store today using my Disneyland bags, yeah. and I've got some just regular Disneyland and some Star Wars bags. Mm-hmm. And the woman started talking to me, and they gave her my card. Oh, cool. Oh, wow. Awesome. I was pretty excited. Yeah. I hate grocery shopping, but that kind of made it all worth it. So sure. let me ask you, when you say bags, I mean, I immediately just thought of the like plastic park bags. That's not what you're talking about. Oh, though, no, the reusable <laughs> shopping bags. Okay. Yeah. Well, because there was a point in time that I would bring all those souvenir bags home with me. Mm-hmm. I don't. I don't know what I thought I was going to ever do with those, but they had the castle on them and they were so pretty. Right. And, and I couldn't bear to throw them away, but I yeah. did. Now 6, I do. 6,000 bags later. Right. <laughs> you might be a Disney fanatic if you're less than three feet away from one of those bags. I can see really? it right there. Yeah. Hold on. Wait. Yep. Uh, she doesn't even have to get it's out right of there. So does that mean that there's oh, something? She's have to get up. No, she's going to get up, but it's not going to be gone for long. I can tell you exactly what it looks like. It's, it's yep. blue, mm-hmm. blue castle on it, and stars. Yep. There it is. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> Do you, when you see a car riding in front of you and its license plate is like CBR, you're like Caribbean Beach Resort? Da, da, yes. Da. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. There's, I was behind one the other day, and I'm like, oh, Caribbean Beach. Da, da, da. You might be a Disney fanatic if you know what the emergency codes are. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Like what the code is if somebody mm-hmm. threw up in line. Or... Yeah. Oh. Like a yeah. code brown. Code brown. Well, yeah. that's an easy Ooh. one to figure yeah. out. Yeah. But still, there's other, there's other ones yeah. that you've heard along the way that you know. 3219. 3219. 3219. 2319. I don't know what 32 is, but I'm like, wow, what is that one? I don't know that one. At least I was close. Sorry. And then you started saying it like that. I'm like, wait, no, that's not. Not a Disney fanatic. Way to go, Kyle. <laughs> Sold me down the river. Not a Disney right. fanatic. No, too bad. You might be a Disney fanatic if you know all the drinks that you can get in every country off the you top of your head. You drunk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You just walk up and they say, you're regular, Kirk, Mr. Greenway? Uh, yes, please. Yes. Yeah, this, okay, maybe. <laughs> I don't. But Surprise don't, me this time. <laughs> no, we have, I will say this, we have never got never. a drink from every single mm-hmm. country in one visit like at one time God, no way there's no i don't way. know how people do that I don't yeah that's crazy yeah i'd no. be asleep i can't even make it a quarter of the way around mm-hmm. you might be a disney fanatic if you can name the countries in order oh yeah that's, that's a good one lagoon. i think we can wrap this up now so thanks for hanging in there with us guys if really you're, appreciate you're, it you're still there you're you're a you're, you you're, are a winner you're a if you're fan. still with us you're a fab four fanatic <laughs> exactly <laughs> and ding, we ding, appreciate ding. you you are a winner yeah in our we, book we appreciate you <laughs> <sighs> all right we uh, tune in next week it'll, it'll be better maybe i don't know oh, that's a lot of pressure what what signs are pointing to that <laughs> just curious i don't know <laughs> just, just hope hope and goodwill <laughs> Hope and goodwill. There's it right here on this piece of paper. Right. Right there. Oh, wait. There's a potato chip back there. I'm sorry. <laughs> that's that's so, good. A little piece of paper. Only, it's getting better one. all the time. Right? <laughs> you just can't eat one. You just good can't night, listen everybody. to one. Good night. Safe travels, everyone. <laughs> good night, everybody. 
We all know vacation planning is stressful and time consuming. Let the expert vacation planners at Mickey Guru Travel Company handle the details and find you the best deal possible, all at no extra cost to you. Whether your vacation dreams are made of roller coasters and princesses or sailing on the open seas, they will help create a magical experience you'll remember forever. To learn more about Mickey Guru and how they can help you save time and money, visit them at mickeyguru.com.